Hi dear diaper wearers. In today's video I will test a new diaper, the Cushies from the well-known company Abu it is this time. Compared to the Cushies, you can immediately see a difference in these other diapers from the same manufacturer. They all have two adhesives on each side, making a total of four. This has proven to be the case and is the case with most diapers. But not with the Cushies. Here there is only one adhesive per side, which is much larger for it, which we will look at in more detail later. The package is again made of transparent, thicker plastic film and I chose size M, on the size chart we also take a look later. The diaper itself is white and made of a film that feels smooth and rather thin, a bit like the retro diapers, completely the same I find it but not, just similar. Colorful printed it is over the entire surface. The adhesive zone at the front is no exception. A transparent strip of thicker plastic has been stuck on there, so that the resealable plastic glue can be removed again without tearing open the outer film. Abu chose not to print this adhesive area in any other way, the imprints start at the top and stop at the back of the bottom. What's noticeable about this diaper is that they've dyed the ends on the side a color that I would still see as blue. However, it is not pure blue, but goes in the direction of purple. This is the primary color, and the side panels in the front and back have it as well. It also dominates the designs on the diaper, i.e. front, between the legs and on the bottom. A single glue to close is extremely wide, about as wide as two normal glues from other ABDL diapers on top of each other. This is probably to achieve a stable fit. Because it is not without reason that two adhesives have prevailed. With the upper one you fix the diaper and the lower one makes it possible, for example, to determine how tight the diaper fits to the legs. In general, this gives stability. With only one adhesive, the diaper might not fit properly either at the top or at the bottom. Like most of you, I am probably used to wearing diapers with a total of four adhesives, so two per side. Especially in the beginning, it was an adjustment for me to place the large adhesive so that the diaper sits reasonably, the first attempts did not succeed, it was too loose. Here it needs rethinking and some practice, although you can no longer influence whether the diaper should be tighter towards the bottom and the legs due to the lack of a second adhesive. I had these concerns before the test. They have been resolved, but for a different reason, we'll get to that later. Now first to comfort and absorbency. If you put the diaper on well and tight enough, you feel just as wrapped up as if you had one on with four adhesives. The cut is sufficient both in the front and in the back. In addition, the outer material feels comfortable. Visually, as always, it is a matter of taste, I especially like the contrasting side panels. The maximum what you can get out of suction was about 1.6 kilograms for me. Here, however, the diaper already leaked very clearly, the liquid stood inside. I would estimate at a maximum of about 1.3 to a maximum of 1.4 kilograms one is on the safe side. When empty, it weighs 182 grams, which makes it one of the thinner ABDL diapers. You also notice that there is not quite as much material between the legs here as, say, a crinkles or rear safari. The suction power is therefore not overly high, but I still find them pleasant to wear. Price-wise, a pack of 10 diapers costs 29.95 euros, so per piece you have to pay about 3 euros. That is a proud price, even if you can say positive, the diaper is completely printed and the prints look valuable, not so pale as, for example, with the Pampers, the overall package does not fit for me. Because the suction performance is in the lower range. Even the pleasant wearing feeling with the film cannot compensate for this. Because there are some other diapers that also have a pleasant outer material, offer resealable plastic adhesives and are printed over the entire surface with bright colors. Here in the conclusion you see several of them. Many offer a higher and sometimes even significantly higher absorbency than the Cushies offer. This applies not only diapers from other manufacturers, but also those from Abu itself. One example would be the Little Paws, which not only offers higher absorbency, but even has a wetness indicator that shows when the diaper is getting full. Price-wise, the alternatives are in a similar range, or even cheaper in some cases. You also notice that they contain more absorbent material. The Cushies folds from the shape especially in front quite quickly, it then looks a bit like a slip. So is the Abu Cushies a bad diaper? Well, if you're mainly concerned with absorbency, I don't think it's worth it because it's too expensive for what it offers. In my eyes, it only makes sense to buy them if you either particularly like the motifs. Or you have a preference for diapers with a glue, in the style of Pampers. This is quite rare with ABDL diapers, I had so far only the Junior Plus in the test, which was quite similar to the Cushies, but printed differently, for example, not completely. 
As for the function of two instead of four adhesives, I see only the small advantage that with two adhesives you save some time when opening and closing the diaper. The adhesive performance is comparable, if you have dealt with it a little. However, with the restriction that the Cushies has yes not so high capacity. Other diapers have withstood 2 kilograms and more. Would they also manage that with the two large adhesives, or would the fit there perhaps be worse? That cannot be said with certainty, because I am not aware of such absorbent diapers with two adhesives. With a higher weight I find that questionable. You have to remember that children's diapers are much smaller and also have to hold much less weight than adults, so two adhesives are perfectly adequate there, unless you're talking about older teenagers, in which case you might need stronger diapers with four adhesives. So all that can be said is that two adhesives instead of four can be sufficient for the diapers with rather lower absorbency. Ultimately, it remains a question of taste and, in the case of this diaper, also of money. It is significantly more expensive than at least comparable or even somewhat better alternatives, which have four adhesives for this. Whether the optics and the advantage of minimal time savings when changing is worth it, that should probably best each for themselves decide. Now I am curious about your opinions. If you want to write, feel free to write your opinion about this diaper in the comments and discuss it with the community. Otherwise, you can also write a comment under this video, how you like the cushies, whether you would buy them or not perhaps also in each case with reasons why or why not. If you liked my video, I would be happy if you press below the video on the thumbs up and maybe even subscribe to my channel to not miss any new videos. It doesn't cost anything to subscribe. Take care, see you next time.